Hey, there you are. How you doing? I'm Joe Pometto, Joe the Lawyer, and I'm reading the greatest book in the world. Yes, that's right, the greatest book in the world. Sovereign Citizens Deconstructing, Decoding, and Deflating the World's Most Notorious Anti-Government Movement. I wrote this book. The color version is right here. You can grab it on Kindle for as cheap as $9.99. The link is in the description below. Go out and grab my book. Thank you everyone for joining me. I'm Joe Pometto, Joe the Lawyer. Today, we are going to take a look at a video that makes me shake my head. Mm, it makes me shake my head, and you will see why. This is a Moorish sovereign citizen. Thank you for joining Attorney Audits Agitators. Before we watch this video, raise your cup, your glass in the air. This is the same time sip. I like Diet Coke. You like some unworthy beverage. Cheers with me. It's a full can. Now let's watch. Been, I've been detained for what? And what is your name, officer? Because I need your badge number. I'm at the BP. I'm 10-4. He's a sovereign citizen. I'm not a sovereign citizen. I'm a more American national, brother. I have a treaty with the Moroccan Empire and right, the United States. Get out of the States. car and come talk to me, please. What do you want to talk about, brother? Step out of the car, please. What crime have I committed? Well, I've asked you to produce your driver's license. I you don't, failed to I, do that. No, I, you, did, you, did, you said I'm grabbing for something. Can I grab it? Yeah, sure. I, exactly. That's all. That's all. That's all. That's all. Where's my ID? That is actually in my, in my book bag. I'm grabbing my book bag. I'm grabbing my bag. I'm grabbing my bag. I have not committed a crime. In order for it to be a crime, there has to be a corpus delecta. What is your uh, badge number? Look, man, we can play this game. You, I don't know crime. you. I don't know you, dude. You have to tell me who you are. <laughs> what? You have to tell me who you are. Where's my ID at? In my my uh, you have to tell me who you are, brother. How can you not? How can you stop me? And you're infringing upon my Fourth Amendment right to privacy. Not infringing upon your Fourth Amendment right, sir. I stopped you for two lawful violations, which are following too closely and failure to make killing. Now, That's let me hearsay. See that Give me that That's light. hearsay. That's hearsay, brother. Now step back here and talk to me. I cannot. Absolutely, for what? you can. For sir, what? Please step out of the car. I need your supervisor. Let me talk to your supervisor, Look, there's, brother. There's, there's, there's I will a need, supervisor here. I now get out of the car. I will need to. Let me talk to you. Tell him to come around and talk to me. No, you can talk to him at the back. So. Can you talk to me, brother? Hey, yes, please. Can I ask for your supervisor? Yeah, my supervisor. Right Thank you. I have not committed a crime. There's no <laughs> corpus delecti or injured party or anything. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm traveling Look, on my own here. here. Get Thank on down the road and be careful, all right? Thank Bye. you, brother. <laughs> Y'all be good, man. Yeah. Hey, no, I want to talk to you. You're the supervisor, brother. Let me step out the car and talk to you, because I'm free to go. I'm free to go. But I wanted to talk to you guys. You guys take an oath to uphold Look, the Constitution, get brother. Car. Get out of here before I arrest you for driving out a license. Bye. I'm not get driving out of here. a license. That's not a license. Get out of here. I'm show you the law, brother. Get out of here. I don't want to hear your law. Get out of here. My friends and family, what is the world coming to? What is this country coming to? I shake my head. I shake my head. The officers let this guy go. They were going to cite him for two legitimate offenses, driving too closely and failure to maintain law, and they just let him go. Then the officer at the end said, well, hey, uh, you know, you better get out of here or I'm going to cite you for driving without a license. That's a fairly serious offense. The other two... I get it, okay? But driving without a license, wow, you know, let him go. Woo, could it be because of everything that's going on in the country right now? I don't know. I'm not a mind reader, but um, I thought it was a little bit silly what the officers did here. You know, this sovereign citizen, uh, more sovereign citizen, asked for the name and badge number, a classic move that never works, only buys time. He said he has a treaty between the Moorish Empire and the United States of America. Oh yes, there's a treaty, but it does not pertain to you, sir. You are a United States citizen who has probably been in this country for multiple generations. That treaty doesn't apply to you. It applied to the citizens of the Sultanate of Morocco at the time the treaty was written. Regardless, it wouldn't give you any special benefits. Go and read it. He talked about the corpus delecti. That's a tried and true fake uh, maneuver by the sovereign citizens. They say, oh, there's no body, there's no injury, there's no crime. 
wrong, wrong. That's not what the corpus delecti means, okay? It can be used in certain instances to get cases dismissed when the Commonwealth or the prosecution doesn't have enough evidence, but you don't need a body. All you need is evidence to go forward with the crime. Corpus delecti use, incorrect. Um, two lawful violations, driving too closely, failure to maintain lanes. Those are good reasons to pull someone over. Those are minor offenses, but driving without a license is generally a very serious offense. Uh, he asked for a supervisor. I like to call that. You guys like to call it. My fans like to call it. Calling back up on yourself, but lo and behold, on this day, it didn't seem to matter because the police, well, they just let him go. You know, let's not worry about it. Get the heck out of here. Um, it was an entertaining, interesting, uh, silly video. I wasn't happy with the result. But if you want to learn more about Sovereign Citizens, oh yeah, I'm plugging my book, baby. Go ahead in the description below. It's $9.99 on Kindle, $14.99 for a hard copy. You will not be sorry. You will enjoy every minute. Thank you for tuning in to Attorney Audits Agitators. Joe the Lawyer out.